Hey guys, today's video is going to be how to rock blue lipstick in kind of a more wearable way. If you guys know my channel, you know that I'm all about like easy, wearable, low maintenance kind of looks and stuff like that. So yeah, let's get started. I'm gonna start by using my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. This is in the shade Chantilly. Foundation, I'm gonna go in with this Cargo Cosmetics Oil Free Foundation. This is in the shade F10. This foundation gives a very natural skin-like finish. It's not too crazy matte, not too crazy dewy, not too crazy anything. I think the trick to doing like a really bold blue lip is just having a very natural look on the rest of your face. For brows, I'm gonna start out with a pencil just to soften up the front of my brows. This is the Gosh Eyebrow Pencil in the shade Gray Brown. For the rest of my brows, I'm going to sharpen it up with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in Dark Brown. give me a little bit of color, I'm gonna go in with this Maybelline Dream Sun Bronzer in 01 Light Bronze, which isn't so much of a bronzer as just like a very natural, peachy, somewhat out in the sun glow. It's pretty matte and it's a pretty like very light color. So again, just keeping with a very like fresh and natural face. It has a little bit of an orangey peachy undertone. It's gonna complement the blue really well because they are complementary colors. Or a little bit of a a glow. I'm going to be using this MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Lights Capage. Now there are two different eye looks that I would pair with a blue or a super bold lip. The first one would be just black felt tip liner or just a black simple small wing. I think any look with just a very simple black winged liner is like very classy and not too much. But I'm gonna go for another look today and I'm just gonna take this cream eyeshadow. This is in the shade Cornelius by ColourPop. And I'm just going to kind of put that all over. Next, apply some mascara. I'm going to do this off camera because I do want to film kind of a first impressions on the mascara that I will be using. Now for the lipstick, I had already put on a little bit of foundation over my lips to neutralize the natural pink red in my lips so that the blue can kind of go on like a more true blue color. But if you haven't done that already, maybe just pat a little bit of concealer foundation. I'm going to line my lips with this dark purple exaggerate lip liner from Rimmel. This one is in the shade 022 Rapture. So the blue lipstick I'm using is literally, I paid one or two dollars for it. It is the Ardeen lipstick in the shade Blueberry Crush. I don't think the US has the store Ardeen's, but if you're in Canada, you know what I'm talking about. NYX has a soft matte lip cream that's like kind of a dark blue. You can also go to Sephora. Kat Von D has a blue one. Too Faced has a blue liquid lipstick. Now this is pretty bold and kind of glossy, but if you want to tone it down, just take a little bit of like white or um, very light setting powder and just very lightly blot your lips with it. And I think just adding that powder on top kind of mutes the color a little bit, makes it a little bit more matte. Anyway, that is it. I personally think this is how you kind of make blue lipstick a little bit more wearable, mostly by keeping a very, very natural rest of the face. And also personally, I think just keeping your wardrobe very neutral as well. Like I'm just gonna wear this white t-shirt today with some black jeans and black booties and a black purse. So kind of makes the lips the focal point and you're not wearing something that's gonna compete with it if you're wearing a lot of bright colors. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this was like a cool video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video.